What's popping my collectors? The Swipe Butterfly Ascension. Coming to give you another reading. I just did my fire signs. So let's see what sign I'm going to do next for the next 72. Hope y'all are safe for the new year. Bringing it in. Remember, this is the year of love. Abundance. And living our best life. So with that being said, my collectors, make sure y'all living your best life. Make sure y'all being thankful, grateful, and humble. The world. So I'm going to do my air sign. Maybe my air signs is feeling on top of the world. Maybe they feel like time is running out. And they gotta make a move. Maybe it's dealing with a relationship that's had you up in your head a lot. Maybe it's a business venture. Whatever the case may be. This card, 21, that represents three, the transit. So this new venture or journey that you're going on, it's going to be blessed. It's going to be abundant. You're going to feel like you're top of the world. You're on top of the world. Maybe you're freeing yourself from... A situation that had you tied. Tied to maybe a water sign. Maybe you're feeling free. Your money may be funny. From closing the chapter. With possibly this water sign. Or my air sign. But it's showing me. Your money not right. Maybe you're trying to balance out the situation. So you can feel free. So you can feel on top of the world. And ready for the next adventure. But you're basically riding off into the sunset. Trying to make shit work. Because you have little. Maybe you're trying to make the ends meet. Trying to balance out a situation. Maybe on a job. Maybe it's with the earth sign. And it's for the next 72 hours. So this is for representation of tomorrow. This could be representation of the day after because it represents three. This is three plus three is six. So all this change that you're thinking about taking a leap of faith with, it may be happening this week coming up. Where there is a change in your money that has you feeling like you want to leave a situation behind because your money is not right. Clarify is two of coins for my air signs. Clarify is two of coins for my air signs. Father God, angels. Show me what I need to see and clarify this two of coins. Clarify this two of coins that's trying to make a decision. Too many cards, y'all. Too many cards. Clarify this two of coins. 
Fair fight is two coins for my collectors. Air signs. Eight of coins. I mean, eight of cups. Definitely leaving maybe a water sign behind. This here has the number eight. So we got two, eight, and six. All divisible by two. So that shows me that you have some type of change in your money. Maybe you have to leave a situation behind so you can balance out your money and start manifesting the world again to be free again. Clarify the world. Clarify the world. Three of Swords. So it's definitely an air sign. Maybe third party situation is now over. Because this is a three. And this gonna represent three as well. Maybe that's why you're feeling free. They have the red right here and the red heart on her cheek. So this man may be feeling free because he's leaving this woman that had him in a third party situation. Had him emotionally in his head, crying maybe, because this card here shows this person is crying. This person back is turned towards all of their cups. None of their cups are full. All of them are empty. Maybe you're drained about this situation. It's drained your emotions. Drained your money, bank accounts. But there is a tower moment coming. But it's gonna balance out the situation. Maybe it is with a king of cups, a water sign, fire sign, but you gonna want your money gonna be back right. See, a ten completion, wish fulfillment, ace of cups. So this person has definitely left you stressed out, crying, up in your head, you lost money with this person, that's caused you to have tarot moments, there will be justice in this situation, maybe it's dealing with a water sign, fire sign, or an air sign. Clarify the six of coins. Father God, angels. Clarify the six of coins. Clarify the six of coins, Father God, angels. I said third party situation. That's another three. That's two threes. And a six. And another three. And this three of cups is in reverse. So you no longer see celebration. 
Maybe with this earth sign, because the car fell on the earth sign. Maybe that's why you're trying to balance out this situation with this earth sign. So you can feel free and happy again. Tired of crying. Your emotions is running over. You're taking the blindfolds off. You're ready to dead this situation. To move on. To have freedom. Say goodbye to his losses. No more taking L's. Because all we do is what? Win, 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 no matter what. So whatever the situation is, it might look bad. It's definitely going to come to an end. But remember, you guys, endings bring new beginnings. Clarify this three of cups for me. From my air signs, clarify this three of cups for me. Clarify this three of cups from my air signs. Clarify this three of cups. Clarify this three of cups from my air signs. Clarify this three of cups from my air signs. Libra, Aquarius. Gemini's. Maybe this woman has color eyes, maybe blue. The one that you broke her heart. And as I say that, it's definitely for an air sign. This is my lover's card. But it came out in reverse. That's another six. So this woman may possibly have red hair. This woman has a red heart, blue eyes. You're no longer feeling the love with this woman. Maybe you've been up crying about this relationship. You're ready to free yourself like Fantasia. Maybe this person likes music. Maybe y'all listen to music together. get it out I was about to say clarify for me this lover's card so this woman is feeling like she's left out in the cold there is a change in this situation fives represent change she's holding on to these two cups and this gentleman here and this woman here is kissing but it's in reverse this woman has black hair these two have red hair Maybe this person, definitely an air sign, defensive, because we got the air sign with the water sign. So maybe you're defensive with a water sign, crying over spilled milk, see these broken glasses, she holding on to these two, but all of these glasses are either shattered or broken. Are empty she looks like she's been crying this woman here has been crying as well this woman definitely who you messing with or dealing with 
has hazel or blue eyes. What's going on, my air size? Either y'all about to break somebody's heart, or they didn't broke your heart. So this woman is defensive because of this man who just happened to might be an air sign. You used to maybe build with this man. These cups are empty. This woman cups are upright. This man turning his back towards her. And then we got my queen of swords. She just ready for war. She ready to cut your head off. If you made the wrong move, she's secure in her mind. She's in, secure in her mindset. She knows which way she wants to go. She knows what she wants. If you treat her with anything less than that, then she will cut you off. She's not going to be a defensive woman anymore. She's grown into this queen of swords. So this queen of swords is no longer crying over spilled milk. Show me the outcome for my cancer. Ooh. Mm. So somebody dealing with a cancer. I said water signs, but this is an air sign reading. So with that being said, Spirit, show me the outcome for my air signs. Show me the outcome for my air signs. Show me the outcome. Defensiveness, sleeping on swords. Up at night because you're heartbroken over this woman that's finally left you because maybe you was playing games. Maybe you were juggling her at one time. Maybe this air sign is going to come to you in a dream. Or maybe they're going to give you a physical message, text message. But you got a message coming from this air sign. Let's see what my cards have to say from the universe. What the message might possibly say from this air sign. Libra, Gemini, or Aquarius. Maybe they're going to apologize. Because maybe they know they fucked up. Whatever the case may be. They're most likely going to tell you how they feel. How they been feeling since you've been gone? They thought they was on top of the world, but they realize now they'd rather be happy with you. They'd rather be with you. And now they're ready to say that maybe this new year has gave them some Things to reflect on. So, I guess it's for y'all. One wish. They got one wish. Just to talk to you. Just to be with you one more time. And you was the gift that the universe gave to them. Go check out Proverbs 11. Maybe it'll give you some clarity.
maybe it's a Sagittarius. Show me what else I need to see. Show me what else I need to see. They say, hey, love, hey, love. They want to bang, bang, bang in my pop's voice. See? Lovers. And they want to know, can you ride stick? Definitely want to um, put the pound game on you. But you said, uh-uh. I'm the gift that the universe gave to you. So when you come... You better come correct so we can have that world. Ooh, nice. Let me give y'all an oracle message for my air signs for the next 72. Let me give y'all the oracle message for my air signs. For the next 72. Your crying days is over with this relationship. You got happy times coming. Definitely self-love. Self-love is the best love. Eye of Horus. So maybe... Horus is in the middle of this situation. It says awakening divine perception. Didn't I just say that? So let's see what this card is telling my collectives. It says, the eye of Horus brings divine perception, protection, and insight. You are gifted with certain spiritual abilities, including divine sight, that are awakening and growing now. You have much divine support and protection so that you may grow your abilities and serve others with your divine gifts. Trust your perception and know that you are divinely protected. So they're just telling y'all to be encouraged. Encouragement will show improvement. Improvement will show just how protected y'all are. The universe got y'all. You see that? The universe is surrounded by y'all. Third eye chakra may be opening up. But look how your spirit guides is in front of you, guiding you. With your staff in your hand, ready. So you may be dealing with a fire sign. And you just don't know how to go back to this person. Because you've wronged this person in the past. With that being said, y'all remember like comment subscribe share my content check me out on tiktok and remember have a happy new year we have blessings and abundance coming towards the collectives make each day a better day than what the next was